Hello everyone, what's going on? Uh, my apologies for not making a video. It's probably been a good couple weeks anyway, right? Uh, but you know, life gets in the way and uh, you know, you got to pay the bills first, right? Um, but anyway, I've got this one here and I've got some more cool videos coming up. So stay tuned for that. We're going to start getting cranked up. It'll be about another week before we really start getting back into this, but that's okay. Uh, you guys will like what I've got to show you. Anyway, so I've done this pan a while back and it's from Spirit. Uh, rover as opposed which which is a change right we usually have uh, most of the time it's curiosity or um it's uh oppie or opportunity so this time we got spirit and i'm going to show you that picture right now uh this one here is from saul 1854 and if you click on the link this is what you get now i'm going to show you i'm just going to zoom in but it's going to break apart but i'm going to actually add some pixels to this and blow this picture up a little bit for you then i'm going to show you the enhanced version okay so the three areas i have that I've seen is this one right here. Now you'll say, ah, oh, this looks like there's some weird block type thing, you know, just like a rock. But you can see right off here to the to the left of that, there's some white. Now when you take the dodge tool and just go over the area, you can just use it like an eraser, like on a chalkboard, right? And just kind of just go back and forth, and you'll actually have things that are lighter, um, like I have like a lighter signature will pop more, and you're gonna see that. I've got that, and what looks like a trap door, right here. Now, you're going to say, well, I can't see that very good. It looks like crap. And you're right. It does. It's pixelated on my screen even. i got high def the whole nine. But uh, people on the phones might say, hey, it doesn't look half bad. But anyway, you'll see it right here. Looks like this big boulder is what it looks like. And then it has this piece protruding out of the bottom of it. And it looks like it actually seals this hole a little bit better. And it has what looks like these two sides to the actual opening. And again, you may be going, oh, my God, I don't know if this guy's seeing. But just, just hold on. You'll see what I'm talking about. The biggest thing for me, now here's another little thing, is this weird kind of disc. It looks like it has something straight here and a disc here. Kind of like those old giant uh, band saws type things. Uh, well, the, not the band saws, but the big, uh, the big bladed swords. Uh, saws are big, pretty darn big, right? Um, this looks like there's some kind of weird opening right here. And again, it's so pixelated, you, you can't really make heads or tails out of it. But what I'm really looking at is this right here in the background. And I'll tell you why it just seems to blow my mind. When you see this, you can see this. Let's go from the left to the right of this. And you can see what it looks like. It comes up, drops down a little bit, and goes all along the front end. I'm guessing it's the front. I'm just saying because it's facing us, right? Uh, it goes like this here. It goes up, over, back down, and then does the same thing. It kind of goes up and then drops back down. But you can see in the back it does this. So whatever this thing is doesn't appear to be just a simple hillside, and maybe you guys will agree, maybe you won't. This is only my opinion and only speculation. Uh, all we can do is speculate in these uh, videos, guys. That's all we can do. I can't literally, and I said this a million times, I can't go on here and say, oh, let's pick this up and find out what it is. There's no way of knowing. So all we can do is speculate, and uh, and it's simply just my opinion. But you guys get the last comment. You guys know that. Uh, just tell me what you think at the end. Anyway, let's jump right into that. And uh, now we've got a little bit bigger photo, so we can jump in a little bit more. And you can see what looks like this weird, almost like darkened... Now, to some people, it looks like a rock, but, some, but to others, it's going to look like an opening. I'm going to show you that uh, enhanced version in a second. But you can see right here, it's a little bit lighter. Down here is lighter, and it has like... I don't know even what this is. I don't know if this is a manipulation, or if it's simply just... Uh, the overgrowth, you know, whatever it may be, like organic life and whatever, right? But this whole thing actually runs over here. You can see where it has this line, comes down at an angle, and then drops down. You'll see it a whole lot better in a minute. Okay, let me jump over here a little bit. I'm going to show you that trapdoor a little bit better now. And this thing is just kind of wild. Um, right here, you can see where it goes like this, comes down, has a bottom, goes across over to here, back down, but has a piece protruding out of the bottom of this, and it looks like it would actually seal this hole right here. You got a little, and then you got, like I said, this like sides, actual sides to the opening. Let me zoom way in here. Well, we can only go up to, that's 430. Let's go keep going. Let's keep going. Oh, we just went over to 500. There we go, 494. That's the close second. It looks like the whole thing would just drop down. Now, people have said, hey, I believe that there's actually underground dwellers, uh, people who are living underground. And it this would actually explain why. I mean, you know, this this would explain why. Um, here's the disc. Here's that weird disc. It almost looks like these, like I said, one of those old-fashioned saws types, like they're belt-driven, um, and it has like what well, looks like something flat right there. I don't, I don't know what that is, but it's there, right? Um, okay, let's go over to the biggest piece I've seen, and I just, I'm just like really blown away by this thing. Uh, let's jump over to here. Now check this thing out. What do you guys think this is? Because when I look at that, I don't see a simple hillside. I see what looks like. 
an object right here. Look at this. It comes up, comes back down just a little bit, comes over to here, and of course you can see this very, very fine line. And of course there's a bunch of little features in here, so it's not just a straight line across. Like you can see like there's some, like one or two of these, but yet it still goes across. Looks like it stops here, goes up, goes across, back down, goes over to here, and then it looks like it comes up a little bit again and then back down, almost matching, like it's symmetrical, like almost matching the other side, and then it does this. Okay? And you can see this other line coming back all the way down to here. Now what's in here almost looks like there's like these other lines. It almost looks like this weird kind of uh, cannon or something sticking out of this thing. You're going to see that a whole lot better too because this is not the enhanced version at all. And I'm going to show you that right now. So let's jump into the other one. Okay. So this is now, and this is enhanced. Uh, and you're going to see exactly what I'm talking about. Now are these just holes in the ground where these people are coming in and out of, and it would make perfect sense. Think about this a minute. You don't have to worry about radiation. I don't care how hard the wind blows, you'll be underground, so clearly that's not going to bother you, right? Um, the only thing they have to worry about is Mars quakes, okay? Um, so that's going to be pretty interesting. Uh, in fact, that reminds me, if you guys have checked the news, the space news lately, they have, uh, they're sending up a, what they call a big air, uh, it's a craft I think it's going up um, this year in fact and what it's going to do is it's going to drill into the ground and it's going to check for temperature it's going to go drill about 15 feet into the ground and they're going to have a little small when I say small it looks like a little dome piece and it's uh, it's going to be for seismographic uh, it's going to be a seismograph on Mars and they're going to just like and they're saying they're just kind of eh, let's see what's going on if there's any Mars quakes or anything like that I have a feeling they're looking for something much more than that what do you guys think? Always, again, leave your comment down below. I think they're doing something a lot more than what they're telling us, right? Um, okay, so let's zoom into... Whoop, not that. Uh, let me just get out of that. Uh, it don't really matter. We can just do this. Zoom right in. Anyway, so let's have a look at this thing. So now I have it enhanced with the yellow and blue filters. Now check this out. I mean, it looks like some kind of weird... Like I said, it does this almost has this kind of weird curvature to it goes like this comes down does this this then what it looks like it has this weird almost like area where it would actually do this it's protruding out of the bottom of this thing and it looks like if it went down if this thing just went completely down like this this area here would seal this hole up now i don't know if you guys can see that but i'm going to zoom in a little bit better and of course you get the two sides here and what looks like an opening right here on the ground. Okay, now watch this. I'm just going to zoom way in and we get rid of these pieces here. Now, let's go in a little bit more. Well, it's 500%. We can't go any more than that before we start seeing that grid. You guys tell me what you think that is because I'm seeing right here. I don't. It looks like some kind of weird boulder, and if they just dropped it down, it would seal this hole. What are you guys seeing here? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Is it nothing more than just simple rocks? This doesn't look like, it looks like it's raised off the ground, like it can actually close into this. You know, here's that wheel type looking thing. And I, where's that other opening? It should be right here. Again, right here in this piece here. And I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in for you guys. And again, you know, guys, I'm gonna be getting a lot more into this, like I said, between, you know, uh, I got jury duty, all this kind of crazy stuff going on, working overtime, you know, making that almighty dollar, uh, if you want to call it that, um, you know, and just, uh, you know, just doing our thing. So just, you know, life gets in the way. Uh, but again, it's going to get a little bit better after about a week. Uh, it'll be about a week. And then we'll be really rocking these big time for you guys. So stay tuned for that. Now, let's go check out this big item here, because this is what blows my mind. This thing here, come on. Look at the size of this thing. And again, it kind of goes up like this, drops down, goes like this. And of course, there's other little, um, went a little, dove a little too deep on that, right? Uh, goes up like this, goes over, comes back down, and looks like it does this and does the same thing, kind of goes up before it drops on the side again. And you can see this, whatever that is. Now, I believe this is something part of something much more, because there's something over here, and I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's something over here too. I actually used a dodge tool, and I could bring on some white over here, which I don't understand what all of that is. I think this is nothing more than manipulation here. All of this right here, this is all manipulation. Um, this here, this thing here, I mean, look at this. Looks like it has this weird protruding object sticking right out of this thing. I'm not sure what that is, whatever that is. And then there's a whole bunch of what looks like openings, one, two, and three. But let's do this. Let me back out just a hair bit. And that's what I got here. 
Now, I did shop in a little bit. I'm going to bring you guys back over for a moment. Should be right over. Whoop. My bad. Hate it when that happens. There's that disc. And, of course, we got that door. What looks like a dr uh, like some kind of, almost looks like a grill cover right there. Uh, maybe that's what they're doing. Maybe they're grilling on Mars, right? <laughs> All you got to do is just leave the cover open. No flame needed, right? Uh, <laughs> not with the radiation. At least that's what they tell us. Um, and something else here, too. I don't know if you guys can see that. So it's kind of like this here. See it? Almost looks like it's got a word right here, but I'm not sure what that is. And, of course, you've got this here. It looks like an opening in the ground. I'm going to get zoom in. And, again, guys, I'm not going to make this one too long. But check that out. What do you guys think that is? It looks like it's something that's buried in the ground or has been buried. Or is it simple manipulation and they're covering this stuff up? You guys be the judge. Um, I see it as, you know, it looks like an opening to me. It looks like there's some kind of a structure or something. And um, it just happens to be in the ground. Kind of like this here. I don't know. You guys tell me. But, I mean, I seen this, and I was just like, whoa, there's no way. Let's suppose for a moment this is nothing more than a hillside. Well, this has got an awful lot of squares and shapes and everything else right in this thing here. And it, it appears to have something else right here going into it. You can see this, like, see how it does this, but it has this one, two, three. Whatever these things are, I'm not sure what the heck that is, but whatever this, whatever it is, it has... What looks like even faint lines going across, coming down. And this, it looks like it extends, you know, past the back of this thing. To me, this looks like some kind of a structure, a spacecraft. I couldn't tell you what that is, but it doesn't look like a mountain. At least not in my eyes, it doesn't. And again, this is only my opinion. But check this out. If that is a mountain, then there's an awful lot of squares, rectangles, and pieces sticking out, and all kinds of weird stuff going on. What do you think it is, guys? Uh, I'll clear it up. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Uh, that's 400%. That's 500%. Anybody on the smaller tablets or uh, phones, you you tell me what you think it is. We're going to sharpen it up a bit. I don't know. You guys tell me what you think it is. Anyway, guys, like I said, I'm not going to make it too long. I just wanted to let you guys see that. Um, I thought this is awesome. I wanted to get this out for you guys. Uh, again, we get this opening here. And let everybody see that up close. That's 500 right there. Percent. We can do this. Blur it up. Shopping it. I got some cool ones, too. I got another pan coming up. This is cool, too. This is pretty neat. Uh, between the pan and uh, I got some moon videos coming up. I know a lot of you guys have been saying, hey, man, do some more on the moon. This is awesome. You know, um, and check that out as well. And uh, I might have a little surprise you guys coming up, too, there. Maybe a, a guest if, uh, if I can get him to jump on board here. So uh, stay tuned for that as well. Anyway, guys, not going to make this much longer. I just want to let you guys know that I am still alive. Nobody has uh, uh, the men in black haven't abducted me or shut me down yet. Uh, although we did have a bad storm the other day. And uh, I know everybody's getting it around the United States as well as around the world. Uh, just different weird inclement weather and all this other stuff. Uh, but it actually knocked the power out here for about an hour, which didn't matter. Um, I'm still on battery backup the second the power goes out, so I don't worry about it. I still continue to do any kind of research, but um, within reason, you can't stand power and battery backup forever, right? So, yeah. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, definitely appreciated. Uh, make sure you share, like the comment, and always uh, like and comment, I should say. Uh, just drop a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Um, are these simple, just, you know, uh, rocks? Or do you think there's, there's more to it? Especially the larger item on the left of this photo I don't believe it's nothing, I don't believe it's just some like simple hillside, at least not with all of this, the shapes that are on it, um, and it's just too symmetrical at the very end, how it just goes like this, goes up a little bit, and then comes, kind of wraps around. Um, it looks like it's either a weird looking structure or some kind of spacecraft. You guys be the judge, drop a comment down below. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.